Today I want to talk about sketchbooks again. Why? Because they're important. When I was in art school, my teachers used to say, draw every day. I always wondered, well, why? And the answer to that is because it makes you better. But even when you're the art teacher, you, you still draw every day. I was at a community function one time. I looked over in the audience. I happened to see one of my art teachers. And what was he doing? He was drawing everything that was going on around us. So that taught me a valuable lesson. No matter how far along you get in this field of art, you still can't stop drawing every day. Here's an example of some of the things I've been doing in my sketchbooks. Here's a sketchbook with toned paper and I just uh, grabbed some charcoal one day and did a, a drawing of my sunglasses. Then a friend of mine gave me a calendar with uh, pictures from the Sistine Chapel so I thought why not learn from the best and draw something of Michelangelo's. I learned a lot in that in that with that drawing. So what else can you do? Where else can you get inspiration? Here, this was uh, a picture I found on the internet of a local lighthouse. And I thought, well, let's draw that. I love lighthouses. What else could I do? Uh, let's see. Oh, one day. So I run Windows 10 on my computer, and every time I boot it up, I get a picture from the Bing website. One day, again, lighthouses. So I just decided to draw that. It took uh, about 10 minutes maybe. Okay, again, another source. I was watching a uh, video on my DVR. I paused it because this looked really interesting, and I sat down and drew it. What did I learn from this? Angles, light, shadow, proportion, and just took about five minutes of pausing my DVR, and I drew this, and it was a lot of fun. So, where do you get ideas? Here's something. There's a mustard jar. So I like to just put things on that part of my sketchbook, and then use this page here to draw it. What else can we set up? Well, art supplies. Let's see. Just grab a couple paint brushes, put them down, Let's see if they can settle. There. And then I can draw those, paying attention to the angles, the lights, the shadows. Again, you can do the same thing with a couple of pencils. Now I just found these. I looked, I spent about five minutes just looking around where I was sitting. And I found all sorts of little things you can, you can draw. There, just a couple of batteries that were laying around. Set them up in an interesting fashion. Look at the lights, the shadows, the lines, the angles. And you can draw those. Here, more art supplies. A little more interest. Throw down a tube of paint. Or maybe all you want to do is draw one or more of your keys. Again, you've got light, shadow, angle, and some dimension. And it's really all about drawing every day anything you happen to see. And that's why we draw every day, because every day we do it, we get a little bit better.